Iowa has a lot more to offer than many visitors realize, from unique beach towns with waterslide amusement parks to towns steeped in history and influenced by a rich Dutch heritage. Visitors to Iowa will be entertained in a variety of ways, no matter the season, from wintertime snowmobile excursions to summertime festivals and flea markets, springtime golf sessions to autumnal walks along the river. Visitors to Iowa will find pleasure and enjoyment in many areas, but it is recommended that they visit many of the state's attractions to get a full picture of what Iowa has to offer. To assist you in planning your trip, check out the top 10 best places to visit in Iowa. Number 10. Iowa City Iowa City, a self-proclaimed community, is located in the state's central southeastern region and is home to the University of Iowa. Visitors to Iowa City will not go hungry or thirsty while looking for something special to please their palate, thanks to the abundance of craft breweries, wineries, and local restaurants. However, Iowa City's true allure is not limited to its museums, local concert halls, delectable restaurants, or universities. When it comes to attracting visitors, Iowa City excels with its seemingly endless lists of events and festivals that take place throughout the year, giving travelers plenty of opportunities to plan their trip around a special event they will enjoy. Number 9. Pikes Peak State Park Pikes Peak State Park, one of the most photographed places in Iowa, is a must-see destination for anyone interested in the state's natural, cultural, and historical resources. The highest point in the park provides magnificent views of the Mississippi River, and the breathtaking scenery is well worth the difficult climb to the top. Pikes Peak State Park, which was established in 1936, spans nearly a thousand acres. A half-mile boardwalk leads to the Bridal Veil Falls, which are well worth a few minutes of observation. You can also walk through the park on the 11.5 miles of hiking trails or spend the night camping at the campground. Number 8. Effigy Mounds National Monument The Effigy Mounds National Monument was established primarily due to the efforts of Ellison Orr, a local born in 1857 whose work was the primary impetus for the mound's eventual preservation. The nearly 200 mounds on display at the Effigy Mounds National Monument are located along the beautiful Upper Mississippi River Valley, which is known for its lush greens and immersive forests. The animals represented range from buffalo to eagles, foxes to horses, and they can all be seen by hiking one of the park's many trails. The park is open all year except for major holidays and is occasionally closed due to inclement weather. Number 7. Amana Colonies German Pietists founded the seven villages known as the Amana Colonies in 1855. Until the 1930s, the people maintained a self-sufficient communal society. Restaurants, craft shops, wineries, and a brewery now commemorate the history and culture of those German immigrants. Handcrafted items can be found at the Amana Woolen Mill and the Amana Furniture and Clock Shop. Dine with your family at the Ox Yoke Inn or Ronnenberg Restaurant, Ackerman Winery, Millstream Brewery and Amani Coffee and Tea all offer bold flavors. 
Visit during one of the large annual festivals, such as MyFest or Oktoberfest, for a truly one-of-a-kind experience. Number 6. Cedar Rapids Cedar Rapids, known throughout the region as one of the best cities for kids, has a plethora of family-friendly attractions, restaurants, and entertainment options. From indoor entertainment at the Plays Station to interactive exhibits and puppet shows at the Cedar Rapids Public Library, children will be kept occupied while parents can relax. The indoor Nubo City Market may pique everyone's interest for a more engaging family experience, while the Speedies Indoor Karting will bring out the competitive side in everyone. The iOS Children Museum is highly recommended for the young learning mind because it has a 28,000 square foot playground for children to investigate and learn while having a lot of fun. Number 5. Dubuque Dubuque's history is as deep as the Mississippi River, which was founded 13 years before Iowa became a state. Visit the National Mississippi River Museum and Aquarium to learn about the river's impact on the history of Dubuque and the United States. View the wildlife that inhabits the Mississippi River. View three different states from the Fenelon Place Elevator the world's shortest and steepest railway. The American Lady Yacht will take you on a river cruise. Visit Sky Tours Zipline Course, Four Mounds Rope Course, or Mines of Spain Recreation Area to get a taste of the great outdoors. Don't leave without seeing the legendary Field of Dreams movie location nearby Dyersville. Number 4. Decora. This charming town in Iowa's driftless region offers a variety of outdoor activities. Dunning Spring Park and Sewers Spring State Park both have waterfalls to explore. View the well-known Decora bald eagles and their nest. Paddle through town on the upper Iowa River. In addition, you can bike or walk the 11-mile Trout Run Trail Loop which connects all of these outdoor activities. Then head downtown for boutique shopping, fine dining, and a look at the Vesterheim Norwegian American Museum to learn more about Decorah's heritage. Make a stop at Toppling Goliath Brewing, which has been named one of the best in the world. Number 3. Pella The abundance of windmills and beautiful European architecture are the first things visitors notice about Pella, a town with a strong Dutch ancestry. The most popular time to visit is during the annual Pella Tulip Time, the first weekend in May, but the town is enjoyable all year. Visit the tallest working windmill in the United States and its corresponding grist mill, the Pella Historical Village, the Monogracht Canal, the Klockenspel, and the Town Square. Stop by a bakery for a Dutch letter, or a deli for meats and cheeses made from Dutch recipes. Lake Red Rock, Iowa's largest lake, is only a few miles away, where you can paddle, fish, boat, camp, and climb the Cordova Observation Tower for spectacular views. Number 2. Okaboji. The resort region of Iowa includes five blue water lakes and over 70 miles of shoreline ideal for outdoor activities such as fishing, boating, and camping. 
Arnold's Park, often referred to as the Okoboji version of Coney Island, is the go-to destination for waterside entertainment. Families unwind in the beautiful state parks that line the lakes and at full-service resorts. Friends enjoy the nightlife by attending open-air concerts and dining at lakeside restaurants. To round out your stay, see a local theater production at Okoboji Summer Theater, watch butterflies dance on the lake breeze at Dickinson County Nature Center, or take a cruise on the Queen II excursion boat. When the weather turns cold, Okoboji hosts its own Winter Olympics and spectators are always welcome. Number 1. Des Moines Des Moines, Iowa's capital and most populous city, is located in the heart of the state on the banks of the Des Moines River. The city has some vibrant districts for visitors to explore, including East Village and Valley Junction, which boast brilliant boutiques and historic buildings. The breathtaking state capitol building, with stunning architecture and a gleaming gold leaf dome, is undoubtedly its most notable site. While its beautiful botanical garden and sensational Papa John Sculpture Park are both well worth seeing, the city has some fantastic cultural events and festivals for visitors to enjoy. During the summer, the Des Moines Farmer's Market offers a variety of fresh produce, cheeses, and wines to sample, while the annual Iowa State Fair hosts a variety of agricultural competitions in the city. Iowa, also known as the Hawkeye State, is a land rich in cultural and agricultural resources. And with its wide open spaces dotted with cornfields and welcoming cities brimming with Midwestern charm, Iowa provides a breath of fresh air alongside friendly communities. We hope you enjoyed top 10 list in this video. Remember to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and leave a comment below with your thoughts. Check out our other travel video for more great trip ideas.